just happens to be your big day. We've got a cover girl with us today. Yes. <laughs> Tiffany Derry, you didn't tell us you were on the cover of a magazine. Oh, well, yes, I am. <laughs> so I, cool. I enjoy golfing, and they were doing a nice, Abby Golfer was doing a nice piece on right. um, golfing and food. So right. it was great. She dices but never slices. <laughs> And a lot of you know her inside. from Top Chef and also from, from being here on Good Day. Yes, I love it. So I opened a new spot. It's mm -hmm. called The Cupboard. It's mm -hmm. in um, Uptown or in Cedar Springs and Ruth. Mm -hmm. We do a lot of healthy cooking. And um, I brought a few of those items. But what I want to share with you today is a smoothie recipe because I like smoothies and I like drinking every now and then, you mm -hmm. know, but all the time, I don't want to like drink on the road. Sure, sure. So this is kind of a way to get all of those vitamins and nutrients. Um, I do blueberries. We're going to do some spinach. We're also going to add in a little bit of flavor of peanut butter. And what I found over time That's is to like, cover up the peanut spinach, butter right? covers every flavor. You know, it's <laughs> yes. like we can hide all the greens we want to hide in there. You, yes, you are exactly right. Uh -huh. So this uh, is kind of like halfway to that green smoothie. Yes. You're not going totally no, crazy. We're still going to get all the flavor. It's, yeah. And this is oats that I've soaked overnight. So like if you've made a nice muesli or any of those things. So you didn't have to cook them. You just no, soak them. just okay. soak them overnight, put them in. And really, it's as simple. So a little bit of banana you can put in. And blueberries, whatever you want to do. Um, and to make it easier, I went on and blended it for you. So when you do a smoothie bowl, yeah. it's much thicker mm -hmm. because you're going to actually sit down and eat it, right? So you have a little bit of your oats. It's what thickens the whole thing, and it makes it quite delicious. So this is for a spoon as opposed this to a straw. This is a spoon, correct. And the great thing about it is you can top it with whatever you want to top it with. So you can do some blueberries on the side. You can do some beautiful raspberries if you like. For me, I want to sit down and enjoy my breakfast. Mm -hmm. And it helps when I can get all that I want, some texture with a little bit of granola. And then you can do sliced bananas. I'm adding some chia seeds to boost up fiber and protein. It's all about using what you have at home, enjoying yourself, um, and, and taking in that meal with your family. And, and that's got some substance to oh, yeah. it, too. It's not yeah, like You're good all driving day. down the road with a <laughs> no. straw. No, 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 no. And we also do a couple of other things at the cupboard, which is an uptown urban market. Mm -hmm. um, we have like a chia seed bowl, which has chia seeds, hemp seed, flax seed, coconut milk, and sweetened with agave nectar. Yum. And then what else did you bring in here? That salad looks beautiful. I brought a Mediterranean salad. Um, has um, toasted and roasted cauliflower. Feta, some roast beef wrap with horseradish sauce, egg salad sandwiches, oh, and you, then our cob, you, you which got would me look at the like egg that. Salad. <laughs> egg salad sounds amazing. Uh, you should have told know. me that ahead of time. I didn't yes. realize that was such a huge seller around yes. here. Yeah. Oh my goodness, this looks good, and I like that the bowl is hearty. Yes. You're right. I mean, just sipping something, you still feel like, well, I still want to eat, eat something. Exactly. <laughs> I'm like, I want something after this, you know? <laughs> so this way you get it all in. All right, we've got a uh, a link with uh, the recipe and, and a link to you. Wonderful. Great place to the cupboard uh, on fox4news.com. We'll be right back with a check of your forecast and see if any food's left when we get back.